The other night I'm on my balcony. I'm having one of those deep, profound, what am I gonna do now that Ronin Force has disbanded and I have absolutely nothing to fall back on except six months of recreational studies moments. You know those moments, we all have them from time to time, I'm sure. Mm. Good chili. A couple days old, that's when it's best, you know? Anyway, I've never told you guys this, but uh, when the aliens implanted me with their alien nanotechnology, giving me my earthquake powers, they also gave me one other gift. Uh, I have the ability to know when anyone, anywhere in the world, is using propane. That's it. That That's the whole power. Uh, it's not something I'm proud of or that I like to talk about because it doesn't fit the earthquake theme. And I'll be honest, it's weird. It's a weird power to have, and I can admit that. I, I don't know. Who knows? I guess that's why they're called aliens, right? They don't think like us. Maybe it makes sense on their planet. Maybe they use earthquakes to start barbecues. I don't know. Where was I? Right. Balcony. I'm on my balcony. And I get the strongest sense that someone nearby is using propane unsafely. So I track it down. And what do I find? It's Fantabulous Gal. And she's using propane very, very unsafely. She's, she's clearly under some kind of mind control. She's zonked out, you know? She's not all there. Just like my wife. Without thinking, I see that she's about to light a match so I earthquake the gas away as it explodes. It was amazing. What up now, physics? Okay, there was some minor structural damage to the surrounding homes, major structural damage to her home. But the craziest part was this. Guess who was sitting there the entire time like a vegetable, didn't react to any of this? Yeah, this guy. And the crazy thing is, I've never done so little and accomplished something so heroic. It's ironic. What else is ironic is that this guy, of all people, Euchre, after all the nasty things he's said to me and, and done to me, he's gonna have to face the fact that I saved his life. I can't wait to see the look on his smug face. It, it doesn't look smug now, but he is normally quite smug. Hey now, watch yourself. I'm gonna Euchre. hand him these deck of cards. Yeah, Euchre, I'm gonna hand him these deck of cards. This is gonna be great. We're gonna play a little game. I made it up, it's called Guess Which Part of Me This Card Has Been Inside Of. Let's watch. <laughs> oh, so, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I know that's rude, you just, you look like such a jackass in the uniform and you got <laughs> chilly. <laughs> War is hell. It's, it happens in battle. This is a uniform, you will respect it. I'm surprised you're not more curious about what happened to you. You went straight for the yeah. jokes, huh? Yeah, yeah. What, what do you mean? Uh, mm -hmm. Like where you've been for the last few months? Um, few months. No? What, what Rodent Force has gone through to rescue you? What, what we've been dealing with? Nothing? I don't know what no? you're... I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't what? remember. What's that smell? No. It's chilly. Oh my god, I'm in your apartment. Yeah, yes. Welcome. Oh god, I smell like your apartment. They got flushable cat litter now, you know? Like, you don't have to live like this. Leopard woman won't use it. She refuses. We tried it once. This is your day-to-day, everyday... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, god. Yeah. Honestly, you get used to it. Oh, you get used god. To it. Do you understand what Ronan Force has risked to save you? To rescue you? We're all lucky to be alive. Just the other day, I rescued you, using my earthquake powers, of course, from an exploding building. You did? Do you recall? Yeah. Yeah, me. It was just a couple days ago. You rescued me? Yes. You're welcome. From from what? To rescue? I don't... From Sucker. The evil computer mastermind. I, you remember that last message you left me? I, I decoded it. It was Sucker. <laughs> I cracked the code. <laughs> the, the video message I made? Yeah. Where I said Sucker? Yeah. I, <laughs> I deducted. I deduced. <laughs> you decoded it? How long did you spend on that? Oh, it was, I don't know. It was six or seven hours. <laughs> Over two days, you know, I have to take a break. <laughs> I had to check some things on the... <laughs> it wasn't the code! I was calling you sucker! <laughs> because I put the Arc Welder's uniform in your locker... Yeah. ...and got you arrested! Sucker! <laughs> you decoded it. I decoded it. <laughs> Have you ever been to prison? Have you ever seen what it's like in there? It's, it's gruesome. Oh, I figured it out. <laughs> So there's no sucker. There is no sucker. 
<laughs> well, you're right you about talk? about uh, a computer, an evil computer, trying to take over the universe called Sucker. You're yes. right about that. See? But that's not what I was saying. <laughs> because the only Sucker I see right now is the one sitting right beside me. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> okay. Well, if I'm such a sucker, then how can I be an admiral? Hmm? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. I'm an admiral. I have my own. I had my own spaceship and crew of space monkeys. They did whatever I said. Oh. I yep. I took pictures. I could show you. It's you. truth. Yes. So you rescued me. Yep. And then you got a spaceship. Yep. Yeah. Well, other order, but yeah. I'm an admiral. 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 More like. Badmiral. <laughs> Yeah, more like Radmiral. More like Mr. Sadmiral. <laughs> more like a uh, well cladmiral. Boom! I think you need another 10,000 hours there, Malcolm Gladmiral. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's clever. Uh, okay. More like. More like. Amistadmiral. That doesn't. <laughs> Guess which part of me this card has been in. Uh, whatever. Do you have any more of that delicious flan? <laughs> <laughs> Just I guess. I decoded it. <laughs> Just guess. I decoded it. <laughs> it was my ass, this one. For those of you playing at home. 